Hi, we're Magma Chamber, uh, Paul, Jonathan, Victoria, and Kevin, and this is Alex. And he's a geometry teacher, middle school probably, and uh, he's a very good teacher, but like he's starting to lose his students, and he wants to find a way to, uh, to get them more excited and fired up. This is Jane. Jane is an architect who wants to share her passion for building and making. Enter Make Match Make, which is a, a great site to match up makers and educators. So we're going to uh, use our site to uh, take your profile information and allow uh, makers and educators to meet up online and share material with the world. Makers will be paired with educators based on a couple different features. So you can sort by the amount of time you have, available resources like 3D printers, uh, standards like Common Core and NextGen, locality if you want to meet up in person, and skills like your profession and stuff like that. Okay, so the site itself will have project material, both videos, step-by-step -step instruction, uh, and, uh, and you'll be able to actually put new projects up as you collaborate with other people, as well as remix old projects. Uh, you'll be able to also select based on uh, Common Core and NextGen curriculum standards, uh, different projects that cover different areas. And then we'll have, also have ratings and reviews of, of material that's not only been created by people and reviewing each other, but also people who have used the same material that was created by others. We also have an opportunity to make money on the site and make it self-sustaining by selling uh, kits for, the, for classroom uh, projects, uh, sourcing materials, as also uh, offering sponsorships for people to sponsor classroom activities. And at the end of each collaboration, people rate each other and they rate uh, the materials they use. Ultimately, Alex was happy because his students were now engaged and got to build their dream houses. And Jane is happy because she got to share her pas passion with younger students. So everybody's happy. Big thumbs up. <laughs>we, we thought we would actually do some initial content development to, to, as a lure, as a bait, kind of. But, uh, but essentially, the, the educators and the makers uh, and, and skilled people working together would create uh, projects. How are you going to create the need for this in the education community, the buzz? The idea is, I think, I think project-based education is, is very much on fire, but, uh, but people don't know where to start, kind of. And so uh, we give them some seed examples, and then also by uh, offering guidance for tying it into core curriculum standards, uh, that, that we're going to, people will find a way to introduce it into their classrooms. So you call it making, but now you're talking about project-based learning. Is it project-based learning? Is it maker education? Do you? It, it, I mean, it's a, it's a mix of both. I mean, the, the makers, and, and when we're, we're using a broad uh, term for makers. I mean, it could be architects, it could be craftspeople, it could be jewelry makers, uh, it could be it could be anything, uh, uh, artists, uh, things like that. You know, you can do book binding with poetry in English classes, things like that. How do you adjust that with the current governing structures? So, so uh, I think if you allow teachers to uh, uh, figure out a way to justify it within their requirements for covering material, they have some flexibility. Uh, and then if they don't, then you can also offer it as, as after school activities and things like that. Any other questions? Administrators, how would they react to this thing like that? So uh, I, I talked to uh, 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 one of the founders of Tenmarks, and one of the things that they did is they, they, they got things up through the ground roots. The teachers start using it, and then uh, eventually it gets well, adapted. It goes from the bottom up. Yeah, that's, that's our, that's Thank our approach. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's give Team Three a round of, four, a round of applause.